They always say your uni years are some of the best years of your life. So what happens when you know you're on the verge of saying goodbye? Yes, I can. Now can you see me? Okay, now I can't. Okay, I can't see you. <laughs> oh, you like golf? Yeah, I play like golf. Um, on the pool, I got many injuries. Oh, oh my gosh. On what? the toes. On the toes. Oh. And then we push onto there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have to hop on, on the bottom of the water. Oh, you have to hop? Because the water is, because the water is getting deeper. You know when the studying gets hard when you have to start busting out your notes, the handwritten notes because my exams are gonna be handwritten anyways. And this is taking me back to my A-level days, my SPM days. But this is truly the best way to retain information. On the way to library to grind our projects, but before that, we have to go to Haiti. Emotional support Haiti. Today I'm gonna go to the library to finish up the report hopefully and then I can finally start studying for my main exam. Shop, but I never got the chance to try. They are famous for their cinnamon bun, so that's what I got. And I got another cardamom bun as well to try. Tomorrow, so I'm heading up to get a few last minute supplies. You wanna get 
get a whiteboard. Not bad, but not good. Today is go time, and how do you know that? It's when I prioritize comfort over looks. I'm having my breakfast now, which are oats because it's a very long four hour exam in person. But of course, I can leave earlier if I finish earlier. So, yes, it's the beginning of my final exam season. The weather today, horrible, dreadful. It's raining, it's cold, it doesn't feel like spring. But the good side is I just finished my exams, so I'm going to have dinner with my friends to de-stress. Hey guys, I just set for my first exam today. I have three main exams. I'm honestly really, really relieved. It's such a burden off my shoulders. In-person exams are so stressful. My previous exams were online, also really stressful because it was three hours for three essays and it's open book and I feel like for open book they always make things really really hard because it's definitely something that you've never seen before and that is a myth. A lot of people think that online exams are easier, well it depends. It's easier because you have access to more information but it's the questions itself are really tough. So anyway, today I had an in-person exam for four hours. I felt like my neck was gonna break off. I haven't really been vlogging as much as I want to and sometimes I feel a bit formal because you know it's pretty much the last bits of my uni life and it just makes me kind of sad honestly. But you know it's okay. This is a digital diary but it shouldn't make me feel pressured to film my life on the days where 
you know, I'm going through it and it's really stressful. We've been progressing to winter weather today. It was so cold. I don't understand what's happening. My exam was from 10 to 2 and I came at home after my exam and took the biggest nap. The fattest nap ever. I took a two hour nap. And the naps after the exams hit different. But one of the best feelings is that I went to have dinner with my friends. I'm back, I'm showered, I'm clean, scrub it up, dog, doing my skincare, and I can relax for the night while watching Modern Family. I love Modern Family. <laughs> protectant which I've already used to finish and a hair oil I got the Olaplex bond treatment and let's see if they are any good let's use the Olaplex heat protectant spray it says you can apply the bond oil to damp hair so this one I'm gonna try just a bit I just finished blow drying my hair and I don't know if you can see but it feels so smooth and I actually have a lot of volume. I don't know if it's because of this um, but it actually worked. I don't know, I was kind of expecting for it not to work. I always have a heat protecting and a hair oil in my routine. I'm glad that these two, wow, amazing combination. My hair feels so great.
get hungry when I'm studying, so having a snack. Hi guys, I just took a shower, a stress shower if you will because when I get stressed out for exams, I start to sweat a lot and I don't really like taking stress showers but it does make me feel better. Can you believe it? My final exam for my uni life is happening tomorrow and that itself brings a lot of shoe pressure onto me. The fact that it's conveniently my hardest paper makes this a very very bittersweet moment though it's leaning more towards bitter at this point but I'm not gonna jinx myself I wanted to go slaying tomorrow it must be slaying tomorrow this module is particularly difficult because even though like there are only four lectures as compared to the rest where I have like eight nine these topics are very very long so there's a huge range of topics that they could test us on i'm gonna focus on a few that i think will come out and i already made essay plans for them like all the mind maps and stuff what i have to do now is <laughs> it's currently 9 30 i'm gonna do the lock in method so i need to lock myself up in a room with a whiteboard all the best to me. I'm going to be spending half an hour to memorize, half an hour to write it down, and hopefully I'll be done by 12 a.m. <laughs> Please see you next time. Hey, you're Jin Hu, the God of Honey Hu.